The Burning Man experience as a whole is not decommodified. We have to buy gasoline and groceries and shade structure supplies, but within Black Rock City, it is decommodified and within the regional events. Because establishing a place where we are free from that is important. Hi, this is Little Jack from Hushville. To me, decommodification is more than keeping commercialism and capitalism off the playa. It extends to ourselves and each other. A commodity is something that can be bought and sold, so it has an assigned value. So in the default world, what you do for a living, where you live, what kind of car you drive, how much money you make is irrelevant out here. And this goes back to the principle of radical inclusion. We're all burners. Hi, I'm Tinker from the MacGyvers Union. And to me, decommodification means repairing, recycling, or repurposing material. You don't have to buy everything you need. Sometimes repurposing means diffusing a bomb with a paperclip in the finest MacGyver tradition. But other times it means making an outfit with repaired cast off EL wire, a clothing exchange vest, and some shelf liner. Don't be afraid to tackle a quandary with the materials you have on hand. I'm Lee from Camp Epic. Uh, decommodification is the practice of stripping relative values. And what I mean by that is that things shouldn't necessarily be compared to each other. For economic purposes, yeah, but for appreciation purposes, you just have to look at something and appreciate it for what it is. Everything is intertwined, everything is connected to each other, everything is part of each other, and therefore it holds an intrinsic value. Hi, I'm Witness from Intergalactic Sasquatch Village, and decommodification means every one coming together as a whole so any one's desires can be fulfilled. Decommodification is a direct result of participation. Hi guys, it's Applesauce from A Shack of Sith. I was thinking about what Burning Man would be like without decommodification. So, I do not want to go to Cole's Costume Cult and buy a purple fuzzy jacket. I don't want a craft sandwich made at Burning Man. I don't want to go find somebody on GlaxoSmithKline in 3 o'clock or Haynes in 4 o'clock. I just want to be there with you and have fun. I'm Weaver from Camp Yes Please and decommodification to me means a break. It means freedom from the bombardment of constant marketing, constantly being told you're not good enough in that marketing, and just allows me to spend a week where I can actually get deeper into immediacy and radical self-expression, radical self-reliance, and chill out uh, and enjoy myself without all of that outside influence. In a decommodified space, we can take off the armor that we wear 24 seven to fight against the world that is constantly trying to market to us. Things are not for sale. People are not eyeballs. Attention is not to be monetized. We are individuals. We are ourselves gifts to be given to one another as opposed to potential clients, customers, and consumers. This break from that transactional mentality is so revolutionary that sometimes we don't even recognize the significance.